For several high school students, attending college is next on their graduation list after graduating high school. And while it can be stressful for some to choose a field of study, Central Lakes College, partnered with Bridges Career Academy, will engage students in a career exploration day to help them with their decision. Our Taylor Archer has more. Central Lake staff and community business members gathered at the Brainerd campus as part of an ongoing process to prepare for the Bridges Career Academics event. To prepare for this, it takes about six months um, of energizing preparation. Um, we work from November until the end of March, with the event being in March. And what we do today um, at Central Lakes College was to gather together about 200 of our businesses and, of course, the college faculty from both Central Lakes College and M State. And we really prepare what is called our cluster teams. These cluster teams specialize in different fields and work in small groups to brainstorm how to engage students in activities on the actual career day. These clusters will meet maybe one to five times before the event and really prepare those hands-on activities for the kids. You want something kind of fun and kind of exciting, but then hopefully then you get the kids there to stay a little bit longer so they can talk about, hey, what do I need to do if I'm interested in this particular career? 24 school districts and more than 2,000 students plan on attending the Bridges Career Exploration Day and CLC faculty credit their success to the Brainerd business community. You know, if you were to go to the different cluster areas that met today, you would see business people in every single cluster area. So what became and what has become of this event and Bridges itself is business drove this program. And once all the plans are made, Career Exploration Day will allow students to explore more than 200 career options. In Brainerd, Taylor Archer, Lakeland News. Career Exploration Day will be held on March 10th. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.